Hi everybody, I'm in my restroom, so excuse the way the audio sounds. So this is how my makeup looks at the end of the day. Let me do a close up. Um, and then around my nose. So that's how my skin looks like up close. Um, in person, you can tell like it's been a long day. Um, but yeah, I'm just gonna show you guys my um, skincare routine. So the first thing I do is obviously take off my makeup. So I'll just take off like my lashes. Oh my! <laughs> I forget that I have no lashes. Um, and then the next thing I do is get <sighs> the freaking lashes stuck to my. <sighs> Look at this. It's stuck to my finger it doesn't want to come off okay there i'm trying to be more environmentally friendly let me put this down um i'm trying to be more environmentally friendly slash um cruelty free so yeah i saw a tweet that said that makeup wipes take about a thousand years to um what's it called decompose and um i don't want to contribute to that so i have made a change to microfiber um cloths which i can just reuse and wash instead of putting um makeup wipes in our landfills for a thousand years so um i did buy 40 and then literally two days after i found out about that so i am going to use a wipe just so i can get rid of them because either way they're gonna end up in the landfill if i throw them away so you, you know so i'm sorry about that i am changing my ways i'm trying really hard but yeah so if you guys didn't know that makeup wipes do take a thousand years to decompose from what i heard so i'm just taking the equate um makeup wipes and just wiping down my makeup Can you tell my redness already? Also, if you just wipe your face with a make makeup wipe and go to sleep, I don't care, but you're nasty. A makeup wipe does not do the trick. You might think it does, but it doesn't. Okay, and also I like to put my hair up in a bun because this, oh, my hair is getting so long. Um, I actually cut it, I cut it up to here about a year ago. It's already up to here. So I'm really happy about that. Okay, let me put my hair up. Alright, just ignore the little flyaways. Um, so the next thing I do is wash my face. Um, I either do it on the sink or in the shower, but I do take the Dove um, soap, the sensitive one. There's, I've seen it at Dollar Tree, so there's no excuse to go wash your face for a freaking dollar. So yeah, I like to take the sensitive one just because I am using it on my face. I don't want it to be that rough. Um, but yeah, so I just get one of my microfiber um, cloths, I guess and wet it and then wet the soap as well and then wash my face we changed angles so just gonna wet this and then let me move my glasses as well as my contacts so they don't fall I i'm trying to get in frame i'm trying to get in frame but i can't Anyways. Oh my Oh that was a close one. That's why I get the sensitive soap. So after that, um I like to take either if it's in the morning, well in the morning I just take this one before I put my makeup on and I will be including it on my um everyday makeup routine so you'll see this 
but in the night time I use the clean and clear night relaxing deep cleaning face wash oil free winds you down washes away daily to build up with sea, sea minerals and sea kelp extracts so I got a new bottle just to get a new bottle and then I take another microfiber cloth like um since I have three I take another one the second one put some cleanser on here there and then go again and clean my face okay and then I just let it stay up for like a minute or so while I wash the um the cloth Then I just wash off my face. The next thing I do is usually I take the um, Vital Vita 12 by Tony Moly. I freaking ran out. And supposedly Macy sold it in Sephora. I went there, they're not sold there. So I think the only way to get it is online. And it's like 20 bucks but this is like the travel size so i freaking run out of that and honestly that freaking works i have this pimple i mean it's going away but this pimple and then this one up here and i started using that product and it made them start going away so i really like that one the next thing i do is take this oil i don't really like to um put a lot of it though so I just like grab that much and just put it on the outer edges. Hold up. The outer edges of my face. Because those are the ones that aren't um that's where my face is really dry at. Mmm, feels warm. Oh my god, it smells so good. It smells like literal oranges. So I don't put a lot of it because I am oily type. So um, it's not really a good combination. But I just like to put it at night to like refresh my skin. Sometimes if I'm lazy, I just wash my face with the Dove, um, Dove, the Dove soap. And that's it and just make sure my makeup comes off so I don't think I mentioned but my skin is um oily to dry is that even a thing I'm not sure but I just know that this part of my face gets super oily and then like the outside is super dry super duper dry so yeah um, this is what works for me um, I don't really have breakouts that often probably rarely um but yeah um i just focus on the redness of my skin you can't really tell right now but i have a couple pimples right there some blackheads and i just focus like on the redness of my skin that's why majority of the time i wear makeup and the bags on my ass because you know school and let me know um some eco-friendly makeup hacks or um changes that i can make in my routine um guys i'm trying so hard not to use plastic and you know trying to become more environmentally friendly but it's hard but i you know i'm just taking small steps so that's all that matters um again oh yeah i forgot to mention i got these um at dollar tree for a dollar three for a dollar whoa that one's still dirty. Um, I got it. I got three for a dollar. So, yeah. No excuses. Um, so, yeah. Let me know as well as cruelty-free, um, like, face washes and stuff. Because I don't know any of But, yeah. So sorry. But I just wanted to include that. I drink a lot of water. So, that's maybe one of the reasons why i have like clear skin not really i understand drinking water is not the solution for most people but i do drink a lot of water have some water right here while i'm editing and only the real ones know that ice cold water is the best water i also drink cucumber 
um, I put cucumber slices in my water as well as chia seeds so I don't know if that's a factor um and I also drink um water as soon as I wake up and before I go to bed so I have water with me all the freaking time thanks so much for watching see you guys next time